Hey, my beautiful Pisces. Welcome to Swift Intuition. It's your girl, Mercy. If this is your first time on my channel, please like and subscribe. If it's not your first time on my channel, hey, fam. Oh, want to give a huge shout out to everybody that's been getting readings and who's been donating. All the information be in the description below. And also, if you want to follow me on my Instagram and my Snapchat, that information will be below too. Okay, messages of love and life for our beautiful Pisces. Give us the information that they'll need until their next reading. Messages of love and life for our beautiful Pisces. Angels, ancestors. Ooh, okay, Pisces. So we have the Four of Wands. All right, Pisces. This could mean some type of home dynamic coming together. The Four of Wands does... Um, does does uh signify you know twin flame union coming in also it's like celebration uh or a home dynamic something that you want to manifest into fruition and then we have the world card pisces this means there is going to be a massive change uh you're starting a new cycle in a home dynamic a home situation uh something that you want to bring together pisces it's like if you're home if you've been let's just say like you've been single all of a sudden then this new chapter is like you actually having this home dynamic you want a new pisces you want a new uh a new foundation created in your home situation. It's like if you've been single, you want to be in a relationship. Uh, if you've been having toxic relationships, you want to have a relationship that's going to bring forth some type of fruit that's going to be healing and not draining. Messages of love and light. Okay. Okay. So we have the six of cups that came out in reverse. Hmm. Pisces, there is something that's happening uh, with a home dynamic that it, the, it's like it's changing. You, I feel like at first, at first there was a situation that you wanted to take place in or, or that you wanted to come to pass. But I feel like it was some inaction could have been on your part or, the, or your person's part, Pisces. Like only one person was working on the situation. It was like only uh, one person was putting in. And now because, because the effort was lacking in the beginning of this relationship, it's like your other person, the new thing is that your other person is no longer giving because, and, and this is something that your person could have felt would have been longevity. This person had, uh, loyalty in you in the, in the past is like this person saw a future with you but now it's like if something has transpired this person's mindset has changed on the situation I see this is just a love and light I feel like at one point in time, if you don't have children with your person, Pisces, your person wanted to have a son. Your person wanted this relationship to grow. But instead of it growing, something happened where it was stopping the growth of the relationship. And now your person is at this place where I don't feel like they want to give to the situation. Then we have the Three of Cups. The Three of Cups speaks of wanting to get together now. Uh, Pisces, if this is you, I feel like right now you want to get together with your person and see if you can create this home dynamic. Now, in the past, uh, it, it could have changed. Uh, in the past, it probably didn't work because there were interference, third-party situations. It could have been, you could have been uh, partying too much. You could have been... Um, I don't know, you could have been hanging around your friends or or uh, uh, basically like listening to other people about your situation with your person. And because you probably didn't act on it, Pisces, now your person is starting this new beginning in life and they it looks as if they're no longer wanting to feed this connection. And remember, this is energy, so it could be vice versa. So Pisces, I mean, it's your reason to... It's your reading, so I am, um, titties look uneven. What's wrong with that? <laughs> Pineapples. But yeah, so, um, so now it's like, and, and, and I feel like with this new, with this new beginning that you or your person is having, it's like, you know, you're, it's like either you or your other person wants to be a part of it. And then we have the King of Cups. 
Pisces. The King of Cups is in the middle of the deck. So it's like you're in this place of really uh, love. You really love this person, uh, Pisces. This is somebody, and at this time, you could be feeling left out in a cold uh, from your person. Yeah, we have a lot of three energy. This is a lot of trans transforming uh, energy. It's like now with the three of pentacles and, and now with the three of cups and the three of pentacles, it's like, uh, Pisces, you're seeing where you could have worked with your person in the past. You, and now this is, and now you could see your person elevating in life without you. And this elevation is beginning to trigger some of the things that caused you guys to pull away from each other. And now you're seeing in the past how, how, how uh how you did not love them the way they, they should have been loving now you're looking in the future to see how can you help or bring about this connection again can it survive and not just that but you're coming from a loving place now i feel like in the past you really weren't paying attention to this person's offer that they offered you then we have the lover's card it's like when this person pulled away from you, Pisces, then you start wanting something with them. Then you start seeing a relationship really develop. I feel like because what was on your mind was the, the opinions of others. Yeah, Pisces, you were worried about the, the, the opinions of others pertaining to your happy ending. Because I feel like you knew this person was somebody that uh, you felt this person's energy, this person's spirit. I feel like in the past, this is another thing that's draining you because this person has a lot of, of energy, a lot of power. And I feel like this person is balanced and you feel that your person will balance you out. But it shows in the past you were bringing instability to them. And now because they've removed their energy, I feel like now you're 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 wanting this. You're wanting them. You're wanting this relationship with them now. Then we have a king of wands. Oh uh, well, Pisces, you win your king energy. Uh whatever has happened, I feel like this has matured you. Because if this person didn't pull away from you, I don't think you would have looked at the darker aspects of yourself because a lot of times we're good with how we are until until something shows us that we that that's not how we should be, you know, like unless something triggers us to actually wanting to uh, check ourselves. I feel like you could have had friends that were okay with however you used to act. And it's like they were yes men or yes women and they were not telling you the truth on your behavior. So that was something you were used to and this person could have brought out uh, things in you that made you actually look at yourself. And now... And now you're seeing this person in a different light. And now you want to bring about this type of relationship. Because I don't feel like this is somebody that you were in a relationship with. You could have had a, a spiritual connection. Could have had a, 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 a entanglement with them. And it was really good. And now, but now you, but now you want to move forward with this person. And I think this is taking you a lot of uh, strength. Pisces, because here it's like if you were not uh, emotionally open in the past, you had a lot of feelings for this person, but you never would communicate it. And it could have been because of third party interferences, what your friends say, what you thought your family would say. And now because they pulled the energy away, I feel like now you want to give this love. Now you want to make a move towards them to see if this new beginning is possible. And then the last card is the Six of Swords. We got the Six of Swords and the Six of Cups in reverse. So the Six of Swords speaks of someone leaving, uh, really wanting to move away from this connection. Someone is no longer looking at the matters of the heart. Um, this gesture that you are, uh, that you're wanting to give to your person, Pisces, I don't think they're going to want to accept it. It's like... This person feels that they finally put all of this pain and hurt, whatever happened in the past, because this person is no longer looking for a four wands. And this could be a very a divine uh, connection. This this looks like it could be um, 
it's a very strong spiritual connection but it's like pisces if this is you like i mean if this is your person it's like your person is ready to lead a situation your person no longer wants to give their heart to the situation hence the six of cups in reverse and this was because it, no one gave you didn't give and then not just that but uh pisces you left this person in uh, you left this person mentally confused on the situation and what and, and what could be what could have been spirit what is the six of swords okay spirit, what is the six of swords thoughts yeah thoughts you have this person stayed in their head about you and you I feel like there was no communication and it's like you kind of just let this person like figure it out mentally on their own when you left or or yeah because something had to have happened in order for you coming back in this energy because the past energy wasn't like this for this person not to want to give to the connection because in the past they were willing to work with you they were willing to to to, to build this with you to financially help you uh, build but now your person is in a new energy i feel yeah your person moving on your person could have uh another love another love interest or another love interest it could be trying to pursue your person at this time um mm. spirit what is this will of fortune what is the will spirit what is the will for that person spirit, what is the will for that person mature Okay, mature man. Okay. So if this official at the end, so if this is your person, Pisces, your person is starting a new beginning with somebody that uh with somebody that's mature, or this could be you about to enter into a new beginning of, of maturity. And I see kings uh kings here, so I feel like in the past either either somebody was very immature in their actions on their love, how they communicated and how they worked her work with others and that has been put on forefront not just that but whatever this new thing is it's like and if it's you pisces i feel like you're maturing this is like you're starting to be more aware of the things that you do the things that you say how you act and and and, and not just that but the, the the shadow side the stuff that we really don't want to work on Oh, Spirit, what is the outcome for this connection? Somebody wants to make something official. Oh, Destin Horizon. Okay, Pisces, you could be getting ready to want to travel to somebody. This, your person could be at, um, and with, yeah, your person could be at a distance. You could be getting ready to want to travel to your person so that you can actually, uh, talk to them about, uh, about the feelings, how you feel. Because I feel like you kept this from them. And it had to be a while because this person is willing to move away. Somebody who was very in love with you, who wanted this four of cups. And if this is your divine twin, because we have the six of cups, which brings up uh, things in your past as well. Like this person really wanted this with you. And maybe you were taking a while or too long to give them exactly what, what they deserve. But now it seems like you're moving towards them. Uh-huh. Uh, it could be for job work purposes and you want to come toward this, towards this person because you want to let them know you see them in high honor. You want to let them know that the things that you've been holding back from them. Okay, I'm going to get two, um, two advice cards or for, for the <laughs> I'm going to get two advice cards from the universe deck. <laughs> I could not talk like what is going on? Stutter, stutter. Okay, uh, that you have options. Okay, that you have options is meaningful. Rock on. So, uh, my gratitude for every moment of your life. Um, spirit saying you should right at this point just be grateful for where you are. Uh, a lot of times, like we always see the the wor the worst p uh, possible outcome and spirit is saying right now like you have options don't don't be stuck in your head about a situation because sometimes when you think long you think wrong and spirit is telling you to start walking in your authentic self and just you know there's options like don't be stuck in your head just do something act act and then we have you are adored right now i feel like a lot of people what they're doing in this state of healing in this time is that 
either you are manifesting uh, manifesting negative things or you're manifesting positive things. Right now, Spirit is saying that you are adored. So be be kind to yourself. You know, some, I feel like whatever this is, Spirit is telling you, it's time to heal. It's time to see yourself in a different light. Because once you begin to see yourself in a different light, truly see yourself in a different light, then you will become to reflect that light that you want to be. You see what I'm saying? It's kind of like, uh, speak, speak to yourself how you want yourself to be. If you see you have lack in certain situations, this is where affirmations come in. You, you affirm those things that you feel that you lack. So once you affirm it, then you're calling that very thing that you lack into existence. So therefore you no longer lack it. Pisces, you are beautiful. You are powerful. Don't be stuck in your head and just know that you are great and you're worthy to be loved. But you have to love yourself first. You have to love yourself first. I love you. Love yourself. Like and subscribe. Hit that, uh, that notification button.